the distinguished delegate of Turkey to make a statement. Thank you, Madam President. On the outset, I'm pleased to extend my hearty congratulations to you for being elected as the President of the 71st session of the UN General Assembly. Turkey, which is a secular country and the country which supports no terrorism, would now be pleased to have your attention to the most sensational and unsolved problem of the Middle East terrorism. Terrorism at any cost cannot be supported and encouraged. The bitter experience of millions being killed and so much blood being shed cannot be tolerated and accepted. How can the United Nations stay calm with these very issues which it is actually meant for? Turkey supports international peace and secularism, and it has accepted very many refugees from Syria and still accepts them only to have peace. The country has also spent more than 4.5 billion US dollars to accommodate the refugees. The country rejected terroristic acts in the name of religion and strongly condemns it. To have international stability, a combined effort is very essential and is required to restore the credibility of the international law. The IS group possesses a threat to the world through terrorism. It is a serious threat that Iraq, Syria, and many other Middle East states are dealing with. The terrorist organization executes prisoners, killers, and actually capable of destroying the world whose power has been sealed many times by the world. We must stop terrorism, and this is possible only by the UN and its decisions. It is not the need of a country or two to make uh, the world free from terrorism. It is our need to free every single nation from the clutches of terrorism. Consider the importance of the issue in the Middle East, the UN will have to take the needed, efficient, uh, needed actions efficiently, effectively, transparently, and in a democratic fashion. The UN political mission should be strengthened, the planning should be reformed, and even the budgets. Terrorism should be strictly abolished from the world to have no more brothers fighting and losing life in the name of religion, caste, creed, color, or land. Thank you.